I scream, you scream, we all scream for ice cream. Well, we are not kids, we are adults. For kids, it's okay to just point it out and say, Mommy, I want that pink ice cream. So in this lesson, we are going to look at some phrases that would help you to order for some ice cream. Ice cream, you scream, we all scream for ice cream. Well, yes. Welcome everybody, I'm Niharika and today we are going to learn how to order for some ice cream. Well, we are not kids, we are adults. For kids, it's okay to just point it out and say, Mommy, I want that pink ice cream. But then we are adults, so we need to order for an ice cream correctly, right? So in this lesson, we are going to look at some phrases that would help you to order for some ice cream. So let's get started. Uh, well, the very first thing that we're going to look at is uh, the size. So when you go to an ice cream parlor or to an ice cream store, now in many countries it's cold as an ice cream parlor or ice cream store where they sell ice creams and the first thing that they ask is um, what uh, would you like to have okay so you're gonna say that I would like to have a kitty so kitty is the size of ice cream okay so it's gonna be a kitty scoop okay which is a very small tiny scoop for little kids or you can ask for a single scoop I will have a single scoop of ice cream or you can say, I'm going to have one scoop of ice cream, okay? Or you can say double scoop. So if you really like to enjoy some ice cream for yourself, you order for double scoop. That's too much of ice cream, okay? So scoop is, uh, the word scoop is a noun, okay? And it's basically, um, it, it's a spoon-like thing. However, the container is quite deep and it's used to dispense the ice cream okay uh, but it can be also used as a verb like um, if you're at home and uh, you offer some ice cream to someone you would say uh, should I just scoop some ice cream for you okay so you would also use it as a verb now here single scoop double scoop it, it has to be used as a noun okay uh, so that's the size now you know if you are very much in the mood of ice cream, you can ask for double scoop. If not, then a single scoop. And for little kids, it's going to be a kiddie scoop. Okay? Now, let's look at some flavors. Now, there are hundreds of flavors, okay? Of course, I can't put all the flavors on the board, but I have some most common flavors here, okay? Uh, we have vanilla, the white, rich, creamy vanilla. We have chocolate, so you can, like when you're ordering for the ice cream, you can say, I'll have a single scoop of vanilla, or I'll have double scoop of chocolate, okay? Or you can say, I'll have one scoop of vanilla and the other scoop of chocolate. Or you can say honey almond. I don't know if you like that flavor, but it's nice and it's sweet and has these crunchy almonds. And then you have butterscotch, okay so um, it's called butterscotch in some countries um, but it's also called as butter pecan okay it's I'm sorry about that it's p-e-c-a-n okay so it's butterscotch or butter pecan and then you have a sundae now what's a sundae okay people get really confused uh, well sundae is it consists of um, two or three flavors okay and two or three scoops and it is topped with uh, some toppings like maybe a caramel syrup or chocolate syrup and some nuts on it so that's a sundae it can be either eaten by one person who loves ice cream or it can be shared with many okay so that's a sundae for you so these are the flavors that we have as i mentioned we have hundreds of flavors let me know which one is your favorite okay but here these are the most common ones now let's look at and what would you put your or scoop your ice cream in okay you're not just gonna uh, give your hands up and uh, the person will scoop some ice cream on your hand right you're gonna have it in something 
So many people prefer having their ice cream in a cup because it's nice and comfortable. You just have to use a small spoon and just eat up your ice cream. But many people, uh, especially kids, love it in a cone, okay? But there are types of cones as well. So there's a sugar cone, which is the most common type. And then you have a waffle cone, okay? A waffle cone is made of wafers and it's delicious, it's crunchy. Uh, you have kitty cone, okay? So that's, oops, sorry about that. You have a kitty cone. Uh, again, it's a very small size cone, which can be enjoyed by little kids. It's very comfortable for the kids to hold it. And then you have a candy stick, okay? Either it's a candy stick, so that's ice cream on a stick. So either it's called as a candy stick or it's called as an ice cream stick. And then you have popsicle. Well, candy stick and popsicle is just the same thing, but in many countries it's called as a popsicle, and in many countries it's just called as an ice cream stick or maybe a candy stick. Okay? Now, if you have to order, you're gonna say, I'm gonna have a single scoop of vanilla in a cup. Or you're gonna say, I'm gonna have a double scoop of some chocolate in a waffle cone. Okay, so that's how you're going to order for the ice cream. Now, many people love to dress up their ice cream. So how would you do that? Well, we have different creative ways of dressing up your ice cream. Okay, it looks colorful, it looks delicious and attractive. So we have some toppings. So we have whipped cream. Okay. So if in case you want to add some extra toppings on your ice cream, you're going to say, I'll have a single scoop of chocolate in a cone with some whipped cream, okay? Or topped with some whipped cream. Or you have sprinkles. So here you have chocolate sprinkles or you have these colorful rainbow sprinkles, especially loved by the kids. And you have crunchy nuts. You have crunchy nuts. You have... Um, Almonds, okay, you have Oreos. These days, a very common topping is the Oreos. So delicious, okay, I'm craving for an ice cream now. And then you have fresh fruits, you know, the fresh cut fruits, they're mangoes, and then you have uh, a pear, apples. So people like to top their ice cream with fresh cut fruits as well. Okay, so these are some important things that you need to know when you walk into an ice cream parlor. Okay, so you don't have to really point it out and say, this is the ice cream I want. Okay, you know what phrases to use to order for an ice cream. So a quick review. Okay, let me order some ice cream for myself. I'm going to have a single scoop of um, honey almond in a waffle cone with some sprinkles, with some chocolate sprinkles on it. Okay, that sounds right. Yes, so this is the way you are gonna order for this rich, creamy ice cream. So go ahead, enjoy, and as I always say, ice cream, you scream, we all scream for ice cream. Thanks for watching, I'll be back soon.